Right now, I want to show you around the external features of the Dual X GPS 160 Sky Pro Bluetooth GPS receiver. And the first thing that I want to show you is the size. For the sake of comparison, here we have a deck of cards. You can see that the X GPS 160 is actually right about half the size of this deck of cards, and it is just about as thick. This is a little bit larger, and it's a little bit heavier than its predecessor, the Dual X GPS 150, but it also is a more powerful receiver. We have one button on the device that's right here, so that's going to double as our power button. You can also use this to start and stop your log recording, but I'll show you more about that in a moment. There is one port, which is over here on the side underneath this cap. We have a mini USB port. You can use that to charge your Dual X GPS 160. The USB charging cable is included with the purchase of the device. So now we have some lights here on the front that I want to show you. So I'll just hold the power button down for a second and fire this up. First one that we have is our battery light. So that is going to be a solid red when you are charging the device, but it'll also give you a warning when it is running low on battery. That'll turn to a flashing red. Next one we have is GPS. So when it is attempting to acquire a GPS signal, this will be a flashing green, but if or once it has acquired that GPS signal, as it has right now, it's going to turn to a solid green. Below that is our log. So that's telling us whether or not we are recording our log from the Dual X GPS 160. We can manually start and stop recording by triple tapping the power button. So once I've done that, that's turning to a solid orange. So I am now recording this information that can be exported as a KML file through the Dual X GPS 160 app. When I am done recording, I can go ahead, triple tap that power button again, and it'll stop. You can also go into that same app, which is a free download, and set it up to automatically start recording a log once the device is turned on, rather than doing it manually. Down here at the bottom, we have five more lights. These are all for our Bluetooth connections. So the XGPS 160 can pair with five Bluetooth devices simultaneously. It is paired with one right now because I only have that one blue light lit up. So it was paired with a Bluetooth device before. So when I turned it back on, it was able to remember that and automatically pair. So that is a quick look at some of the external features of the Dual X GPS 160 SkyPro Bluetooth GPS receiver.